parks, most everyone takes pictures. Such is a common occurrence, but sometimes the way you take pictures might not be the safest or brightest idea. There are some things you really should not do when taking pictures at state parks. Don't go off trails to take pictures. It's sometimes really tempting when you see this one scene in the forest and you really, really, really want to go and take a picture of it, but that's not the best idea. Especially if you're alone, because you could really get lost, even if you're close to the trail. Let's go yeah. and take pictures on the wrong side. Yeah. Hey, no going off the trail. You want to stay on the trail at all times. But why? You, you might get lost. Yeah. But where's your friend? It's, it's dangerous. You could trip and fall, get eaten by coyotes. You Where know, what are you, my mom? <laughs> I'm the park ranger. Thank you very much. Well, I really think we should listen to her. I mean, she just, you know. Yeah, sorry about that. We won't do it again. Could you take a picture for us? No. Go! <laughs> Second, don't block the trail. Rude. Others might be trying to get by. Oh my goodness, I can't get by. Can you guys like move? No, we're taking a picture. But you're taking the whole trail. Okay, and? Vince, you need a permit for that. There was this one time a group of Vikings were at a state park and they were having a scene. They were dressing up. Now usually, you know, if you would do that, that's fine. But they were fighting with realistic weapons. And you know, that's pretty scary for a natural, you know, a usual person if you did not know what was going on. So if you're gonna do something like that, please, ahead of time, apply for a permit. That way you can have a state park ranger supervise you and they can uh, warn past buyers, hey, it's okay, no need to be scared.